I'm walking out of the house now. Get it closed up. And then I'm going to begin. I believe it's exercise, walking, and talking day 55, I believe. So, I'm all clan. If you enjoy my content, please hit the subscribe button, like button also. Share with your friends if you don't mind. Also, please comment, ask me a question, or comment in general. I'll do my best to answer them. Also, if you don't mind, hit the notification bell down below, and you will be notified when I go live or upload another video. I keep saying when I go live, and it will be pretty soon. Uh, this video of exercise, walking, talking, I'll be telling my thoughts about the TV that I have. Uh, it's uh, uh, if I, so my thoughts on 4K, the TV, um, and also my thoughts on the PS4 Pro, and what have I been up to lately. So, uh, yeah, um, the 4K TV uh, that I have is pretty good. I like it. Um, I noticed one time during I was playing a game uh, when it got to some dark scenes. Uh, it could really you could really tell that the TV was having a hard time with the with the dark scenes a little bit. I mean, it could be a heck of a lot worse though. Uh, but yeah, uh, the TV is really really good. Uh, it's pulling out some beautiful graphics on the PS4 Pro. So I'm 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 satisfied with the TV. I really like it. I mean, I had a hard time trying to get the TV to work. Um, I still am planning on getting a remote and a proper power cord for it. But not anytime soon right now cuz I want I'm going to save my money. So I'm using a Samsung remote, but it's a remote off of another TV that we have that we don't really use all that much on the back porch. So I'm using that remote to control the TV to actually make it work, and it works perfect. Um, but someday, yeah, I will get the proper remote that I need for it, and a proper power cord, and all that, and... I can't remember if I said already or not. I can't remember if I said or not. But I, me and my dad found the screws to the TV stand. So I didn't have to uh, buy any screws for that. But my dad did buy some screws. But it wasn't the actual screws that we needed. So he said he was going to keep those screws instead of taking them back. But yeah, we was able to use the actual screws for the TV because they came with it actually they actually came with the TV so that was great but uh yeah uh, TV is good I, I really like it I'm satisfied with it I'm just happy that it works and thank God that it does work <laughs> boy that was a situation I tell you so next time I buy something from Amazon around that price probably won't be anytime soon uh, for something like that but if I ever do again uh, I'm just going to go ahead and get a brand new one I mean yeah I don't want to go through that mess again that was a bunch of crap I tell you if you don't know what I'm, what I'm talking about I think it's my previous uh, uh, walk and talking uh, exercise walking talking video is the previous one where I talked about the situation with the TV so yeah that happened now the PS4 Pro my thoughts on it uh, it's fantastic um, I have really noticed uh, that it's really making some of the games look better I know it has a combination between the TV and the PS4 Pro all combined together uh, but yeah the PS4 Pro is great it's fantastic I'm really loving it more than the original PlayStation 4 so yeah it's really good I really like it 
Uh, it's good. I love the fact that it has more storage than the original PS4. The original PS4 had 500, but when you turn the console on to boot, to boot it up, it's not exactly 500 because some of it is used to turn the console on. So you have a little bit less than 500. And with the Pro, it's a terabyte, which is a thousand gigabytes. And it was the same deal with the original PS4. So you don't get the full terabyte uh, storage, but you get a good bit. Uh, I think it was about 800 and something gigabytes or somewhere around there that you have to play with for games and stuff. That's pretty good. Um, I've So I've put a good bit amount of my games on there. Not a, not a good chunk of them. Not a good chunk of them. But I put a quite a few on there. And I will be streaming hopefully pretty soon. But some of the games I got to let's just say play through because there's certain moments in the games when I last streamed them so I got to get back to those points again and then I can start streaming them again and plus if you noticed in my last uh, pickups video I have Horizon Zero Dawn I've played it just a little bit it's my first time ever playing it. Um, I do want to play on it some more so I can uh, get some hands-on experience with the game. So when I stream it, hopefully I won't have too much trouble playing it. And I know it's a uh, it's pretty much an open world RPG so you go around collecting up items and you have to pretty much figure out what you're going to do on your own. Because I don't think there really is I think there is a, a map. I think there is a map in the game. But the game doesn't hold your hand, so you got to figure it out pretty much on your own. So that's going to be a little bit of a difficult for me for a little bit. But I'll have to figure it out. But yeah, I, I turned the game on for a little bit. It's a beautiful looking game. Uh, it looks pretty much the same way that I remember of what I could have imagined uh, from the PS4 Pro reveal event when they showed off Horizon running on the PS4 Pro. It was gorgeous, but I was watching the presentation on a 1080p screen and it looked good. And running on the Pro on 4K with HDR it looks good. It looks beautiful. So, yeah. Fantastic. So, so you already know one of the games I've been playing, Horizon Zero Dawn, just, just very briefly. So, what I've been up to is lately, I've been playing PS4 games. I've been playing Ratchet and & Clank. And it looks so much better running on the Pro. I mean, this game looks like that new Ratchet & Clank game that's coming out on the PS5. Graphic-wise, it looks almost like the same way. I mean, it looks really good on the Pro. Uh, so yeah, uh, so I've been playing Ratchet & Clank. I'm very close to beating it. I believe I'm at the end of the game, I think. All right, I'm gonna play some more of Horizon Zero Dawn. And I think on the side, about whenever I get ready to do some streaming again. Um, I think I'm going to replay through the Uncharted games. I have them on my PS4 Pro. I love those Uncharted games. And the Tomb Raider games. I have them on there as well. I'll probably play through them again. Fantastic games. Both of those series. are just fantastic. Um, and it's like... Uh, but the games I want to get back to streaming again is... Um, the Last of Us Remastered. I gotta get back to the part where I last left off from streaming. I think I was playing as Ellie. And I was doing some hunting in the snow part. So I gotta get back to there again. 
and then they'll may cry five uh i don't think i was too far into the game but i gotta get back to where i was i think i can pretty much remember now and i was also streaming a little bit of meta evil got stuck on that but i want to see what i can do about playing some more of meta evil and same goes for um little nightmares i gotta get back to where i was and then i may uh stream some more of crash bandicoot insane trilogy just for fun uh, i'm not worried about all that stuff the reason why i got to play all these games to a certain point again is because my save files was on my original playstation and i can't port them over to the new console ps4 pro because my original playstation is gone so i can't transfer the data over all my save files are gone but luckily all my trophies and all that are still there because it's all connected to the playstation account so all that information is fine and good to go so that's good about that but everything else save files all that it's all gone so yeah Oh, and I also might uh, uh, play some more Spyro on the side, Reignited Trilogy. But I've pretty much streamed all three of those games. Not completely, but pretty much. But yeah, that's what I've been up to. That's my thoughts on the 4K TV that I have. And also my thoughts on the PS4 Pro. Really loving it. Um very excited about the PlayStation 5 because uh, you have to have a certain uh, I think you have to have a certain 4k TV for the uh, PS5 to be compatible with I'm really hoping my TV will handle it hopefully I guess I'll find out because if everything works out I'm gonna get the PlayStation 5 so yeah really looking forward to that because of that new Ratchet and Clank game I mean, there's tons of other games. Horizon Zero Dawn 2. Uh, the Forbidden West is what the title of it is. Um, I mean, there are so other many games on there. That that Kena game, uh, Bridge of Spirits, that looked amazing. Um, I can't think of the other ones right now, but there were just so many fantastic games coming out to PlayStation 5. Oh, uh, Sackboy and a big adventure that looked good uh but yeah awesome stuff all right i'll probably soon think about ending this video now i'm not sure what else i can talk about but i believe this is exercise walking talking day 55 i believe it is my memory is really good all right finish my walking and soon upload the video and i'm gonna do another video today also y'all probably do the next uh what's inside the latest game informer so i'll probably do that one later on today as well all right thanks so much all right bye